Hi everyone, I am super glad to see you on my channel and my name is Pucha. Today I am back with another crafting video about coffee paper patterns. Well, I am not into paper crafts much but I totally love hand painted and handmade papers. I usually use them just to make small appreciation notes or abstract art mostly for wrapping paper. Not just this but this can be used in those small business wrapping gifts very easy and affordable to make. So let's get started. For the first pattern, I started making rainbows in different sizes. I had two coffee, a light and a dark shade. I started with a light shade and ran over some part with a darker one. Then I made second arch without waiting for the first one to dry. But you have to make sure that they don't mix into each other. And lastly, I had this raw instant coffee. I added few drops of water in it and, make the, and made the darker shade. I filled third arc with that and I made tiny rainbows to fill out those large gaps. Coming, coming on to second one, this is my favorite and I simply dipped the water glass into the coffee mixture and printed it on a paper. Only thing you have to remember to make this is to look at abstract. And lastly, I made splashes of props with the brush. Third one is daisy flower and I make a center part of a flower with the coffee so I made oval shapes from the light shade coffee and once it was done I used the same uh, I used some dark shade to bring over some texture in it and let those dry. I drew petals with the pencils first and I made a final print using the thin point sharpie. Well, fourth one is triangles. I do not like it much, but this can be used as abstract art for sure. So, especially when you make it in a square or round shape, it will look much better. I followed the steps as before and I made triangles with light shade and then over it again with a dark shade to make it look more textured. Moving on to fifth one, I had this giant brush. Uh, I dipped that in a coffee and made a good splash on pa paper. And I let that coffee water drip on the paper that made a stem for the flowers. And once it was dried, I highlighted with the dark shaped strokes. Sixth one is somewhat like coffee cup paints. I made abstract tiny I made abstract tiny and large rounds with lightest shade I had so that it can look candid coffee drops and um, I filled the edges with a dark shade. Just like before, uh, I made splashes of the drop with brush. For the last one, I used fork to make uniform lines. I simply went over the paper with that line in vertical and horizontal way and I finished that with a print. And this is how I made it.
I hope you have enjoyed the video and do not forget to give thumbs up to this video and hit the subscribe button. I will see you all in the next video. Bye bye.